Credit cards and scams. Hitting the licks in the. What's going on, guys? Hope this game is well working on it. Jamie and Jacob here. Today, we are going to be showing you guys some Infinite Warfare. I keep trying to say Infinity. Infinity yeah. uh, it's Infinite Warfare. Just dropped last night uh, from when you're watching this. And a lot of new stuff has come out about. Um, it's called the Bio Spike. Feels like reminiscent of the days when Advanced Warfare brought out the uh, spike, drone. spike drone, but it's not. It's going to be different. Um, this is hopefully going to be the throne knife replacement. We've got a lot to talk about. Um, we've just collated some clips and stuff that we've seen overnight. Um, so we did scour the internet. Uh, we went for a little bit of a hunt this morning on multiple YouTube channels, and you'll see those in this video here, courtesy of those guys for uh, sort of, well, they're not letting us use it. We just took screenshots mostly, we're not stealing their gameplay footage. Uh, but we're gonna watch through and have a little peek at the gameplay segments that we got here. This is uh, from the trailer, so uh, the first looks of the trailer, we also grabbed some quotes about what the bias bike actually is. It's a throwing knife that explodes on impact, so there's a big game changer there. Um, a bias spike acts like a throwing knife, however, when it's hit and it's hit its intended target, it causes shrapnel damage to its surrounding enemies. So, as you can see in the trailer, he throws it, he gets the shotgun pop, and then he throws it, he kills, and then he gets two uh, two people on the kill feed. So it's really, really kind of interesting dynamic that we're going to be playing with this year, because if you're throwing and doing this, like, this is already a two-person feed so far. So, if you're into knife feeding or anything like that, it could potentially mess you up. If you're throwing for one person, it blows up the other person. You can see the cursor um, on here, and you can see how it explodes when it hits on impact. Yeah, so very similar kind, reticle. Kind of mess with people a little bit. Yeah, I very feel. similar reticle to ghosts. Um, so the reticle is going to be exactly the same. I'm not yeah, I'm not sure how it's going to work in terms of its feeding kind of thing because as you can see on the feed, he gets two throw knife kills, even though one was an impact kill. As you can see there with that screenshot, also um, you can retrieve them and it sticks out of the person just like Modern Warfare, uh, sorry, Black Ops 3. One of the things we took a screenshot here was on Noah's channel, he showed the Reaper, and you can go look this up, we didn't want to include it in the video because we want to be short and sweet, but the Reaper is like a melee version, you run around like a dog on all fours, and it's basically like the, what was the guy with the knife in this the one? Ripper. The Ripper. It's like yeah. the Ripper, uh, except you just lunge as a dog. You've got the bias spike here with that description there as well. It looks kind of weird, it looks like a mix between a throwing knife and like a a shock charge yeah. looking design. And then um, at the end of the trailer we've got this little, uh, this another grab of um, another feature of the throwing knife or the bio spike and as you can see throws it across, very obvious what it is in the air there, the clear. shape, it hits him in the head, explodes and then this guy next to him also dies from impact. I just, I'm really worried about the feeding aspect of this, you're gonna be like, throw it into a room and it can just kill like five people. Yeah, one, one of the things I'm actually worried about is when you're going for a feed, you have to prioritize a lot when you're knifing, and if you're going for one, and then you go for another guy, but he gets blown up, and then the guy that you didn't go for lives, it's gonna get kind of frustrating, so you're gonna have to judge. We looked at the uh, the bank shotting aspect here, whose gameplay was this from? This is Pomage's gameplay on Chaos's channel, but it does bank off the floor, um, I do a little bit of a zoom in here so you can see, but we definitely got the nose sticking to the ground, here. It does do a bounce. So, we don't have another advanced warfare situation where it just sticks into walls, but we look like we're going for a bit of a ghosty sort of thing. It's going to be a slide yeah. angle. I think it might stick into things, we're not sure yet. But uh, that's so far a lot, we could a lot to look forward to. Um, so yeah, to wrap up, it's, it's a throwing knife that explodes on impact. Um, so yeah, but don't know what's going to happen there. Um, it throws exactly like it would on Ghosts or Modern Warfare 3. You've got the same reticle as Modern Warfare 3 and, and Ghosts. One interesting thing, forgot to mention, you throw while holding your gun out. Yeah, that's a massive uh, I a don't massive know if we have a clip game of that. Here. We do have a clip here um, on Chaos's channel. Yeah. As you can see here, he's got his arm out throwing the knife and the sniper. So that is that is completely it's different to any changer. other COD. I wonder no. what silent shots are going to be like. You could do a silent shot at the same time yeah, if exactly. that still works. So that's an interesting aspect. We hope you enjoy it. And uh, we'll hopefully have a little bit more news on some of the melee gameplay. As you can see on our channel, we've done a lot of, uh, what are we playing at the moment? Black Ops 3 melee challenges. So. It could potentially be a thing. Hopefully it doesn't get as ridiculous as Black Ops 3 in uh, Infinite Warfare. We're not going to see any baseball bats or ridiculous buzz saws going around. <laughs> but it's still going to be fun to do some melee challenges and we'll see you on the next one. See you at the beta. Yeah, the beta. Going to be playing the beta. Whatever date that is. Peace.